In a Tibetan monastery in southern India, Buddhists pay homage to the reincarnation of a senior lama. They believe Ling Rinpoche, once senior tutor to the Dalai Lama, has been reborn and is blessing them and the gifts they bring. He's here in the form of a five-year-old boy. The ceremonies have lasted all day, and in mid-afternoon, this remarkable infant still behaves with the composure expected of a high lama. Those who queue for a blessing are from many parts of the world and many walks of life. They include Richard Gere, the Hollywood film star. For 30 years, scientists have investigated other children who appear to remember previous lives. Tibetan Buddhists say they have their own ancient methods to precisely identify a child like this. The reincarnation of an 81-year-old Lama who died on Christmas Day, 1984. Is there real evidence for reincarnation, a form of life after death? Tibetans believe senior lamas who choose to be reborn can be traced by an ancient formula. This includes looking for mystic signs in the flame of a butter lamp, consulting oracles and astrologers, and meditation. The Dalai Lama led the search for Ling Rinpoche. A year after Rinpoche's death, search parties went to various Tibetan settlements. They returned with long lists of possible candidates. The concerned people, you see, gave me um, full, I'll say, one quite big batch of paper on the list of the name. Then, through my, my own investigation, um, not there. Then I asked them, not here, even though, you see, more than, I think, oh, 500 or something. Um, then I, I told them, oh, it seems not here, <laughs> that they are disappointed. But then somehow, they again, you see, start to find them. Near Dhamsala, the place called Beer, one child somehow, you see, they uh, missed. The child was found in this orphanage at Dharamsala. His mother had died and his father was too poor to support him. The infant was 21 months old. The search party said he appeared to know them. One member was a servant to the dead senior tutor for almost 50 years. Chanda. The infant passed the recognition test. He could identify belongings of the dead monk from similar articles. He was declared a tulku, a reincarnated lama. He was examined by the Dalai Lama, who said the child knew his way around the palace and seemed to recognize former colleagues and servants. The new Ling Rinpoche was taken to meet the people in Dharamsala. He was barely two years old. His personality and bearing helped to convince the Tibetans and others that he was truly the reincarnated senior lama. When I met the young boy the first time, right after he had been identified, he came and jumped into my arms and patted me on the head. It acted very much like he knew me. And although I did not believe in reincarnation uh, at the time, or I would, had no evidence uh, at the time, when I met this young child, I was absolutely certain that it was him, that it was the old man. It felt exactly like it was the old man back again, uh, acting the same way he had acted uh, when I had seen him, which was seven years before. Today, this child is five years old. The orphanage is a distant memory. The old servant is now the boy's guardian, and they live in a bungalow next to the Drepong Monastery. 
At the end of this day of ceremonies, the boy, now Ling Rinpoche, will become a monk.